South Korea is seeing a growing number of COVID-19 infections as the country posts its actual highest tally for a Monday in six weeks. What we've been seeing here is a return to five-digit figures in recent days with the daily tallies for both Saturday and Sunday surpassing 10,000. Chairman Jung with this report. South Korea is witnessing yet another upward trend in COVID-19 infections. On Monday, the country reported over 6,200 new cases. It's a jump of more than 2,800 compared to the same day last week and is the highest Monday figure in six weeks. Over the weekend, the country's daily tally surpassed 10,000 for two days in a row. Usually, the figure for this period drops as fewer people get tested over the weekend. But these figures signal a change in the trend. And with cases increasing, concerns are mounting over the possibility of another surge. The number of infections will increase continuously until winter. Given that the BA4 or BA5 strain becomes dominant, we predict at least 150,000 to 200,000 cases will be reported daily. It's possible to see another large-scale infection, like we did when the Delta variant was dominant. The authorities say there are numerous reasons behind the latest surge. We believe increased indoor activities and people traveling during summer, waning effectiveness of vaccinations and new strains of COVID-19 are the main causes. The number of imported cases is also on the rise. Pundits say this is mainly because more people are traveling across borders with eased travel restrictions. In preparation for a potential surge this coming fall, Health authorities are gearing up to closely monitor the country's medical system and ensure there are enough hospital beds for those who need them. Chemin Dong, Arirang News.